Hi, I'm Amit Prakash. In our Customer Experience Explorer series, today I'm going to share about my experience as a customer of SLR Revolution. But before I get started, here is a disclaimer. This is not a paid or promotional sharing. This is a genuine customer experience. SLR Revolution is an online and brick and mortar local Singaporean retail store for cameras and lights. We wanted to upgrade our studio setup for virtual live training, consulting, and keynote speeches. A speaker friend of mine recommended me to go to SLR Revolution. Now let me share my customer experience with them. As a customer experience designing and training company, we divide customer experience in four stages. Stage number one, pre-sales. In this stage, based on the product or service, the brand and marketing teams make a promise to its customers. Here, when I visited the website of uh, SLR Revolution, they promised me to offer competitive pricing and value-added experience with outstanding service. Kudos to them for promising to keep their customers in the center of their business. Most of the companies promise, but not all manage to live the promise. It's easier to promise than to bring it to life. So what happened in this case? Let's see in stage number two which is sales. In this stage, the sales team brings the promise to life, makes a sale, and reiterate that the same promise will be lived by the customer service or operations team. Here, when I and my lovely wife Shivani went to their store, we were greeted and assisted by a salesperson named Winnie Lowe. Since we didn't want to go wrong in upgrading our training studio, we had a lot of questions about different products and brands. Coming from sales background in hospitality and service industry, I can vouch that Winnie was cheerfully answering all our questions. Not just that, she was living the role of an advisor by asking about our needs and customizing solutions accordingly. Winnie was truly living a brand promise of value-added experience with outstanding service. This resulted in us buying from her even without any discounts. Kudos to the SLR Revolution team for bringing the promise to life. Now let's move to stage number three, which is customer service. In this stage, the customer service team lives the promise without any gaps in between. Here, I must say that, again, my customer experience was top-notch. I had some additional questions. All the questions were answered well as promised. Kudos once again. Last stage in customer experience, which is stage number four, is customer feedback. Finally, in this stage, the customer feedback team, which includes pre-sales, sales, customer service, and leadership team, ensures to understand that customers are experiencing the same promise offered by the brand without any gap or breach in between the customer journey by collecting feedback and acting on them. Here, I did not get any feedback request but I got a reply to the Google review that I posted sharing my great customer experience and appreciating Winnie living the brand promise. I would like to think that this is the reason I did not get any feedback request. However, collecting customer feedback and acting on them is as important as making a brand promise and bringing it to life. So this was my overall experience. This is how we review customer experience and share with you. Stay tuned for more customer experience explorer series stories. If you have experienced any positive or negative or even mixed customer experience, email us at amit.prakash at motivusconsulting.sg and we will share your experience with a credit to you in the next customer experience explorer series. Thank you and see you soon.